What's up guys, Miranda here, and today I have a Dollar Tree haul for you. It's been a minute, you guys. Like, I wanna say at least a month since I actually went to like Dollar Tree to actually take the time and just look around at all the new things. Yeah, I kind of pop in for like my garbage bags, laundry soap, that kind of stuff, and obviously the movies, I would go just for that, but actually look around, you guys. So, <laughs> I went to four stores, you guys. This is a super mega ginormous haul. Um, so this may be a bit of a long video. If not, I will maybe do a two-parter. I don't really know yet. But yeah, you guys, I have several, several items that I'm so excited about. Lots that were on my wish list that I want to share with you guys. So let's go ahead and get right into this haul. All right, so first up, you guys, I do have some candles that I'm pretty excited about. You guys know I love the Dollar Tree candles. And I'm not sure what brand this is, but we have this Tropical Fiesta. And of course, the cactuses. So I had to get it. It does smell really good, though, you guys. It's very like fruity, almost reminds me of like, um, I don't know, it's like a creamy kind of smell to it, almost like a smoothie sort of scent. I don't know, but it smells really, really good. And then they had the pineapple punch and you guys, this smells so like spot on pineapple. Oh my goodness. And then we have the luminescence pumpkin spice. They have a few other ones that I'm on the hunt for. There's like the marshmallow, fall leaves, and one other one. But this definitely has that pumpkin spice scent to it. So perfect, perfect for fall. So nothing special, but I needed a couple of little towels just for my bathroom. So I picked up a couple of these black ones. I have some green ones, but they had either black or like one other color. So I just went with black. All right, so then they got in these new RM Oral Charcoal Flossers. You get 50 in here, um, but these are totally new, you guys. Um, they're activated charcoal floss, detox your gums, dislodge and remove food, removes plaque, and reduces tooth decay. And I thought that was pretty cool because you guys know, like, charcoal anything is supposed to be, like, you know, really good. So I picked up a couple packs of those. Next up, I found a couple of puzzles I was on the hunt for, and they are, why did that come out so weird? I don't know. <laughs> um, but they're the round ones, you guys. And this one is the 350-piece Wild Horses, and it is my crazy art. But I like that it's round, and we do have a horse, you guys. I know we went from three horses to down to just one. So, yeah, thought that was really pretty. Then I found this one here that is Noah's Ark. I just thought that was so, so pretty. And then I couldn't remember if I had picked this one up or not. I may have this one, but it's this 500-piece uh, succulents by the brand Cardinal, which is the Greenbrier brand, but super pretty. Then I finally came across this freaking fan. I got this for a friend, um, but yeah, it's super pretty. It has the rainbow colors. Okay, you guys, and then I found two of my little jars that I was on the hunt for, you guys. I'm hoping to find some more because I actually want to use these for like little spice jars. Um, and it just has like a little stopper thing in there. One of them, the stopper thing doesn't work very well. So I need to figure out a way to like make it stick better. But yeah, you guys, this is so stinking cute. They also had ones that have, um, I think one says blessed. Another one has like a rooster on it. And I think there's one other one. I think it might've been a heart or something like that. But oh my gosh, these are just so stinking cute, you guys. And they are actually pretty like decent size. Um, so yeah, I'm really, really hoping I can find some more of these. All right, next up, I came across some of these long wooden signs right here. I think these are so cute. So I got the two that I mainly wanted. Um, there are four total. I did find the one, the coffee one, but it was like totally, totally messed up. So I'm hoping I can find another one of that. Um, and then there's also one that's more like for your laundry room that says so fresh, so clean. But I really wanted this one right here and it says, I think I'll just be happy today. And then they also had this one here that says, go out and do amazing things. And I just thought these would be super cute for the kids' room, just kind of inspirational. Um, so I'll be putting those up in their room. 
So I finally freaking came across the 2021 calendar with the pineapples on it. I just thought this was so freaking cute. So you have the calendar, you have a little note thing, and then you have this one here where you can, uh, it says shopping list on it. But literally, I went to like three different stores and none of them had it. They had all the other ones except this one. And then I finally went to another store and they had it. So I'm very excited that I came across that. Then I also came across this advanced coloring etchings, vintage style illustration, uh, like an adult coloring book. It is one of the thinner ones, but I thought that this was just so pretty, you guys. Like the images in here are just so beautiful. So, so beautiful. There's a fox there. Let's see what else is in here. Let's find another one. Got some like flowers there. And yeah, I just, I had to get it. Couldn't pass it up. Then I found some new uh, coloring books actually by Crayola. Um, and this one is the Cosmic Cats. So I'm not sure you get 64 pages in here. And they're just some like really fun designs and stuff, you guys. So they had that one. They also had this Unicreature. So like everything with like a unicorn horn on it. This one also has 64 pages. There's some of the pictures there and then the last one that i found is this hashtag squad goals same 64 pages and let's see there's just some of the design so super super cute and it's crayola brand you guys their coloring books are expensive all right and for fall not that i'm really into the red truck you guys but a friend is so i did pick up some of these harvest blessings with the red truck on it these are placemats you guys and they are 13 by 18 inches so perfect perfect for the fall time now you guys nothing is in like any particular order like there's just a whole bunch of random stuff so i did come across these cute little feline first little cat toys and you have a little burger and fries um, I've seen somebody haul or post a picture of one that was like bacon and eggs, like a over easy egg and a like slice of bacon. My store didn't have that one. They just had these ones. Um, but I just thought these were super cute. They're really, really soft and they have like that like crinkly stuff inside. So perfect for our kitties. Um, and then I came across this beauty cube makeup brush drying rack. I thought that was kind of cool. Um, I'm going to be doing a hopefully makeup giveaway soon. So this will be going into that, but I thought that that was pretty neat and it shows you right there just how they kind of like sit in there and everything. So pretty cool. Now I'm a sucker for cute magnets, you guys. So I did come across this one that says, let us always be friends. I don't think I got this one. I hope I didn't get this one in like some friend mail, but so, so cute. So I had to get that. Then they had these really adorable, oh my goodness. Okay, so the one store that I went to that I found these little notebooks at, you guys, I had already paid. And then like out the corner of my eye, I saw these and like, luckily my sister was with because I was not about to go get back in the line and, you know, wait forever. Luckily, she was like a couple people behind me. And so I gave them to her and she just picked them up for me. But you guys, these are so stinking cute. Um, does it tell me how many sheets? It doesn't say how many sheets are in here, but this one, oh yeah, it does, 50 sheets. And it's this Jurassic World, but it's, you see how it changes? Um, oh my gosh, what the heck is this called? Why can't I think of it? Ah, I should know this. I should know this. But yeah, you guys, pretty cool. <laughs> Let me know. I, I totally spaced on what the heck the word is for that, but um, lenticular. Lenticular, there you go, how it looks like that. So that's pretty cool. They had this one, super cute. It's the Disney princess. It goes from uh, Ariel to Moana. And it said, actually, let's see, what does it say? Uh, um, find your own voice. No, voyage. Oh my goodness. It's hard to tell, but <laughs> pretty cool. And then this one, uh, I love this one. And this says wickedly cool and then call me queen and it's from descendants we love the descendant movies you guys it's from descendants three so wickedly cool and then it changes to uh what's her face aubrey it says call me queen so cool so i thought those were so stinking cute then I also came across this, which I thought is pretty cool. I've been hoping to find the My Little Pony one, but I have not found it. But it is the chalk set, you guys. And my son's birthday is coming up here um, next month in October. So 
yeah you guys it'll be like a perfect little gift for him all my kiddos they enjoy playing with chalk and i just think it's really cool how they are um the shapes of the transformers all right, you guys, so Dollar Tree has been coming out with some amazing like wall art and just unique little like decor pieces. It's kind of overwhelming, but there's just so many like beautiful pieces out there right now. And I went a little crazy, you guys, I did. So first up is this little, what is it, like a hexagon. Um, it says bless. It has that kind of peachy coral color in the back. They also have one that has a rooster on it. It's red in the back. And then there's one that has an elephant. And I forget if it's like blue or gray in the back. I just picked this one up though. Super cute. And so it's like thick enough so you can like just stand it up on its own. Um, Christmas is already out, you guys. Like some Christmas stuff is slowly coming out. I found a couple signs that I was on the hunt for. Oh, this one's kind of messed up. I didn't see that, but oh well. It's okay. Um, but I did find the Santa and the Snowman. Merry Christmas, Susan Greens. There is an elf that I'm on the hunt for. But the store I went to only had these two. They didn't have the elf. Weird. But uh, yeah, and the elf, he says, oh, what does his say? I don't even remember. But I picked those up. Those are super cute. This sign is just so funny, so cute, you guys. It says, bring me coffee and tell me I'm pretty. And it's kind of like one of those little shadow box signs. Um, I lucked out on finding this because they had a couple other ones, but they were like completely like broken. Um, so this was the only one in good condition that I found. And then it does have a little thing in the back that you can actually like hang it up if you wanted to, or you could even just like set it up. Hey, just a fair warning, you guys, there will be lots of cactuses, okay? <laughs> All right, so first up, they had these really cute little signs here, you guys. They're kind of like, a, you know, a square, almost like a shadow box kind, and then they have the really big beads on top. So cute. I only picked up this one, though. It says, keep that same energy. I just, I love that. It's such a cute saying and just so, like, positive. Um, they also had one that said, be you. It was, like, red writing, and it had, like, a heart on it. I was tempted to get that one and then for some reason I didn't and I think there was one or two other ones I don't really remember but this I had to get then you guys I found my little signs these are like those hanging kind of shadow box signs this one the only thing I don't like about this one is like the pink it's so hard to tell like what the word in the back there says but it actually says imagine and then each one has like a little like white outline kind of like house looking thing so there is this one then we have hello these are just so cute you guys i just i could not pass these up then we have create so, so pretty. And then the last one is Dream. Okay, and like I said, you guys, no joke, no joke. I went a little crazy with the uh, wall art stuff. So let's get into the canvases. This one is so freaking pretty. I just, I love it. This rainbow cactus, the flowers on it, the blue background. It's just stunning, you guys. I was so happy to find it. There's still like one more. There's a couple more pieces that I'm on the hunt for. One is a, a cactus canvas. And then the other one is this sign that says, um, I'm not weird. I'm limited edition, something like that. That's like so me. It screams me and I want to find it. Um, but I did come across this pretty canvas here. It's actually like has like some gold outlines. Probably doesn't pick it up too well on camera, but I thought that was super pretty. Um, this is not cactus, but I thought it was really pretty. It's this unicorn. Um, I have something in mind for this. And this one also has like some gold outlinings there. Um, then we have this one. This is like uh, this little succulent one in a bowl. And I thought that one was super pretty. Some more cactuses here <laughs> by the time this video is over you're going to be sick of cactuses um this too I, I just thought this was so cute you guys so so cute then we have love grows here you have the cactuses as well this one i just i love it's coffee it says mocha espresso cappuccino breve i don't know what that is Coffee latte is always a good idea, and I just thought it was so cute. You got the little cups stacked there. We have, I'll never desert you. I will never desert you, I promise. 
Um, this one's so cute. My dreams are calling and I must go. I just thought this would be so cute for the girls room. This next one, oh my gosh. Three stores, no luck. Fourth store, bam, I find it, yes! I was so freaking stoked. I was doing my happy dance in the store, you guys. I found this, I wanted this for my son's room. This is sharks. I just think this is so stinking cute, you guys. So you got the whale shark, the great white shark, the tiger shark, the hammerhead shark, and the nurse shark. And I just thought that that was so, so cool. Um, then this one, sorry about that. Um, but like I said, they just have some really cute freaking little wall arts and canvases out. It's just hard to pick and choose, you guys. But I really wanted this one. I thought it was cute. Thought it would be good maybe like for the bathroom or something. Have a little B on the tag there and it says home. Then we have this gathered together and you have these little succulents in a pot here. Um, oh, yes. For some reason, I thought this was a canvas and it wasn't. Um, but this one I had to get to perfect for the girls room. It's another phone and it's like this little stack of books here with the leopard print and everything. It says slay all day. Oh my goodness. So freaking cute. And then this one I'm a little bummed about, but then again, I blame the dude that was bagging the stuff because he had no idea what the heck he was doing. Like, I don't know. Um, so the glass got cracked, but this is so pretty. Um, I'm sure I probably have like another, not even the, not even the frame, but like, I, you know, one of the pictures that I might not want to put up anymore, I could just grab the glass from there, put it in here, and it'll be fine because really, you know, you just want the frame and what now or you can even do without the glass doesn't even really matter um but i had to get this one i just i love the colors in it it's so beautiful then i did go ahead and just pick up this little set of pens you get 12 in here the little halloween pens get all these little different designs in there i thought those would be cute for the kiddos okay so moving right along i did come across some new blind bags you guys so they have these little squishland toy surprise um they look like this and you get a little squishy toy in here. And I actually, I think I read on here it's supposed to be a pencil topper. Had I have known that, I probably wouldn't have picked them up. But I did. Um, but because I don't really care for those. It's not really much of a toy. But um, yeah, so they are. They're like little pencil toppers. You can kind of see there. They're on pencils. Um, but you get a pencil topper in here. And then you also get a little card, like a trading card kind of thing in here. Uh, yeah, and you also actually get a game code because I guess it's like a game. So if you were into that kind of thing, you get a game code in here and everything. So that's kind of cool. Um, then you guys, we recently got some of these in friend mail and my son, he really liked them. So I picked up several of these. These are the incredible little blind boxes and it shows you all the different characters that you can get. And I'm not sure, I think this might be from Incredibles. Oh yeah, it is Incredibles 2, duh, this is right there. And then even though we have not seen the movie yet, I was very excited to come across these. These are the Disney Pixar Onward blind bags, you guys. Just finding blind bags in general at Dollar Tree is a steal of a deal, you guys. So, so awesome. So I literally picked up every single last one that they had in the box, um, but you get just a little mini figure in here. Uh, yeah, one figure. So, so cool. All right, you guys. So next up, I finally, finally came across the little cat toys here. They have like a little kind of bell inside. You can barely hear it, but they're the ones that are shaped like little candies. For some reason though, I thought that these were a bit bigger. They're actually pretty small. Um, but anyways, we have the Junior Mints. I know these came out like, I wanna say last year, but my store just finally got these in. I hadn't seen them at any of my other stores. We have the Tootsie Roll. We also have Dots. We have the Sugar Daddy. We also have Razzles. I don't like these really long tags on them though. Like why? What a waste. Like there's like a gazillion of them on there. And then we also have the Blow Pop. So I thought that was pretty cool. And then I did also just pick up a little bowl here. I know there's a dog on it, but I mean, I wanted this for like my cat's water because they've been drinking water through crazy, like crazy. So the one that they have is just not big enough. So wanted to get them that. All right, so next up, Christmas ornament. I was on the hunt for these and I just think that these are so, so pretty. So it's like this little ballerina here. She has the uh, like kind of feathery, I don't know furry little 
skirt there but she's so so pretty kind of wish they got them like in other colors or something that would be kind of cool but i picked up a few of these for our tree and then i picked up a couple of cups um so my kids love spongebob and they had this new one that i had not seen before so you got patrick on there you got spongebob on there and i just thought it was so so cute we have like a ton of these these are like our daily cups that they use and stuff so got that one and then this one i thought was so cool for my son um it's this batman one you got batman and the joker you got the joker there and then batman I am on the hunt for the baby shark one, but I cannot find it anywhere. I want that one for my little list. So hopefully I can find that soon. All right, and to add to the pen collection, we have these little novelty pens. These are so freaking cute, you guys. So you have the burger and then you have the fries and you can even see here, you have like the fries with the ketchup and then this is layered like a hamburger there. So you can see like the cheese, the tomato, the bun, all that good stuff on there. So I thought that was super cute. And then they had this one, which is also so adorable. Look at the little blowfish, you guys. That is so stinking cute. And then the little turtle. They also had one that was kind of like comic, like it had those like comic words, like bam, wow, whatever, something like that. Um, but I didn't get those ones. Um, and then I finally came across these little Shopkins pins. I was on the hunt for these like forever and I finally came across them. These are super cute. Then I found this really cute list pad that says Sweet Life and I just love like the background of it. it. Has like little like soda bottles and they have like the different little fruits like you know probably like grapefruit. There's like blueberries on this one. Not blueberries but like a blue raspberry kind of thing. I don't know I just thought it was cute so I got it and it does have the magnet on the back and you get 60 sheets in here. Okay you guys so my girl Bonnie over at Bonbons Hall she recently sent me some of this in friend mail and oh my goodness you guys i don't know why i never realized that they had these at dollar tree but you guys i am like so in love with these they're so freaking good this is the wiley wallaby um soft and chewy classic red and i believe this is isn't this the strawberry one? Oh, it yeah it is it has strawberries on it what the heck natural strawberry flavored licorice so it's kind of like a mix between like a red vine and kind of a twizzler it kind of has that texture of a twizzler but they're like super thick and they're so good so spot on strawberry flavor like if you haven't tried these definitely try them out i do know they have a like black licorice flavor one as well which i'm kind of curious about because i do like black licorice so I may have to find that, but I definitely picked up several bags of this because like I said, I am like, this has become a new fave of mine. All right, next up, I came across some new cotton candy. It is the Rainbow Sherbet. You got the little unicorn on there. I don't know if it actually tastes like Rainbow Sherbet, like if it's supposed to be like a Sherbet flavor or if it's just like the colors of like the Sherbet ice cream, but go ahead and try it out anyways. I'm assuming it's probably just going to be the colors and it just tastes like normal cotton candy. But if it's like sherbet flavored, then that's awesome. Um, but yeah, got that. Then I also picked up just a bag of the Brock's Autumn Mix. I was hoping to find just the, um, just the pumpkins because those are like my absolute fave. Love candy corn. But they didn't have any, though I know Dollar Tree does have them. But I picked up the Autumn Mix so you get like the... The ones that are like the chocolate flavor, the regular, and the pumpkins in here. And then I did also pick up just a bag of the regular candy corn. All right, a few little beauty items here. I did come across the Real Techniques. Um, it's the uh, Base Expert Air Cushion Sponge. I said I'm, I know nothing about beauty, you guys, but I've seen people hauling these. Like I said, I'm going to be doing a makeup giveaway hopefully soon, so that will probably be going in there as well as the four miracle blotting cushions don't know um and then everybody i've seen hauling the new flower products i guess it's the drew barrymore line i wasn't familiar with it um the i did come across the nail polishes and stuff but i'm just i'm you guys know i'm not really one to like really paint my nails but i did pick this up this is the tickled pink oh gosh what is this called transforming touch powder to cream blush and it's the tt2 and it's like this really pink color you guys it's like a very strong pink for blush yeah 
Then I picked up this adorable pair of socks. Heck yeah, I had to get these, they're so cute. They are the fuzzy socks, which I'm not a huge fan of, but I just, I needed these in my life because the orange and then the little candy corns on it are just so stinking cute. I did pick up some gloves, you guys. I'm actually very impressed at like the quality of these gloves. So I got the women's one. They had different colors, but I think the black one was probably like the best. Um, but they are, they're very like comfortable, very cozy inside. You can see kind of what it looks like inside. You can see it's very soft, very fuzzy in there. Um, definitely like perfect fit. And I also got a pair for hubby here. Again, they also had like other colors and stuff, but he likes red, that's his favorite. So got that for him. And then I did pick up some socks for the kiddos cause they had these new, uh, brand of socks which I remember seeing a couple months back but I don't think they were these exact same ones but this is by bum equipment um but what I like about these is you get a two pack here you guys so two pairs of socks for a dollar but they are these really nicely cushioned ones they're very thick and they just feel like really good quality, you guys. And my kiddos were just kind of in need of some socks. So I picked these up. I should go back and get some more because like I said, they do. They're just nicely like cushioned. They're really thick. And that's kind of what, um, you know, they need right now, especially like with winter coming up and everything and falls here already. Um, some thick socks is good. And it also has um, that kind of like breathing, what do they call it? Breathability arch support, cushion sole, moisture control. So yeah, you guys, awesome, awesome. So I got those ones for my son. Then I also got him these ones. Then they, they have like different sizes. So I got these for one of my girls. So these are like the crew socks and then these ones are a little bit longer. And then they had these ones. I think I picked up like almost one of like every color that they had there, so. All right, you guys, we are down to the last few items. So I did come across this spa haws. I have no idea how you pronounce it, but it's the hair therapy keratin oil shampoo. I thought this sounded really cool. Just the whole keratin oil kind of sold me there. There's a unique blend of fortifying keratin proteins to help resist strand breakage and further enrich with argon oil to condition and nourish your hair. It is a 14 flow ounce bottle. All right, and the rest, you guys, is soap. They've gotten in some really uh, kind of cool, different scented soaps. One that I am like really obsessing over right now, you guys, is the Suave Juicy Orange. Um, yeah, you guys, this stuff smells amazing. I love it. It's just, oh my goodness. This is like perfect year round scent. So definitely if you see this, pick it up. It is a six point flow ounce little bottle here, but I picked up several of these because I am in love with the scent, you guys. Um, then they also have the Dermacil, um, the extra moisturizing hand wash, um, and this one is the Cool Melon, and then they also have the Cherry Almond here. So you got those. Then, what else? Then I just picked up a couple of these. Um, they had the Bath and Beauty Liquid Hand Soap, but this is the Antibacterial Hand Soap, and these are 16.9 flow ounces, you guys, so really nice size. They had it in the lemon, and then they had it in the regular, and thankfully my stores right now, they, have, they don't have like the limit anymore for like products or anything like that. I know some stores still do, um, but you know, I still kind of stick to it, but I did go ahead and pick up some of these. Um, especially since they are the antibacterial ones. So that is it for my haul, you guys. I kind of hauled a little bit of everything from the store. So yeah, you guys, I was so excited for lots of these signs, especially on this cactus stuff. I'm so excited to like start decorating when we get into our new place and everything. Thanks for watching, you guys. Join the family if you have not, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.